بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أهبت في الله الله سبحانه وتعالى says في كتابه الكريم يا أيها الذين آمنوا اتقوا الله وكونوا مع الصادقين الله سبحانه وتعالى says O you who believe fear Allah and be of the صادقين أحبت في الله الصدق Truthfulness Truthfulness leads to piety as the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that we have to be truthful we have to be truthful in all that we do even when refuting Ahl Bidah even when refuting someone who's made mistakes from Ahl Sunnah that the point being Ahabat Allah that Allah has commanded the believers Ya Yaladina Amanu Kunu Ma Sadaqu This is Allah addressing the believers not addressing Ahl Kufr He's not addressing Ahl Shirk but he's addressing Ahl Iman. Ahl Iman, be of the Sadiqeen. Be of those who are truthful. So, Abdullah, I want to encourage myself and my brothers and sisters to be truthful when dealing with one another. And to be truthful even when refuting one another for their batal or their mistakes. Whatever the case may be, even as I said with Ahl Bidah, we have to be truthful. We can't lie and exaggerate. That takes away from the argument. It takes away from the issue at hand. And it doesn't benefit the believers at all. And it contradicts the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And it contradicts what Allah Azza wa Jal said. Ya yuladina amanu. Kunu ma sadiqeen. Be with the truthful ones. Be of the truthful ones. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has commanded us to be from them and to be with them, to be with those who are truthful. So strive your best, which is very simple. Refrain from lying. Refrain from excessive exaggeration. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Wa sallallahu wa sallam. Ala nabiyyana Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.